In this lab video, you are going to investigate the motion of a small toy car using a position versus time graph. To get started, mark with a dry erase marker on the floor a small line and write start next to it. Then have somebody get a stopwatch ready and another person put the car behind the starting line. Start the car and as soon as the car goes across that first line that you drew, start your stopwatch. As the car moves, you're going to have somebody call out every two seconds, mark, mark, mark. And another person is going to be following the car and marking the front of the car. You got to make sure you mark the front of the car or else it doesn't work. So mark, mark, just like that. After you've made 10 marks, you are going to use a meter stick to measure the distance between each of the marks and then also the overall position of the car at every two seconds. So let's say in the first two seconds it went one foot, in the next two seconds it went another foot, and then in the next two seconds it went another foot. You would say that it goes from zero to one to two to three feet, um, and the position would get bigger, whereas the distance between the marks would stay the same and still be only one foot. Once you've filled out all of the data on the front table, then you can turn to the back draw a position versus time graph and get started on answering the questions. As soon as you get in class, uh, you will see on this front table, the cars uh, and the dry erase markers. Meter sticks are in the lab supply area that you are used to finding them and you can go ahead and get started right away. 